Well, this is the Farmville Glass Station. It's a facility that's being operated by East Carolina University, and we are teaching a beginning glass blowing class here as part of the art program. Let me flash and I'll show you where my, the imaginary line in my head is. Okay, so this curve here is what I call the shoulders, and where it gets straight, I'm heating to back there. I gotta heat past the shoulders, because otherwise when I open it up, I could end up with a very annoying concave lump. With the equipment we got, we have room in the class for eight students. We got five enrolled this very first semester for the very first glass program being taught. And what we practice here is glass blowing, which is an over 2,000 year old art form. You literally gather molten glass, 2,100 degrees, onto the end of a steel pipe, where we literally use our breath and inflate it into forms. Blow a little harder. Stop. So I'm hoping to get the students to get that little bite, to get them interested, and perhaps they'll be able to take glass in directions that we haven't seen before because we've always just been focused so heavily just on blowing the glass and not how it in integrates with other media. Okay, you go ahead and take care of the block. I'll take care of rolling for you for right now. Remember, very gentle with the block. Don't press really, just let the glass ride on the surface of the block. I try to, try to not limit myself when it comes to the classes that I take. I try to be very uh, versatile, so I think this is a great class to start with that. You also have to maintain like making sure the glass doesn't stay too hot or making sure that it's not off balance, so keeping it rotated to make sure that, it is, that all of those things work perfectly, it's very difficult. In the future, I would love to be able to have a full glass concentration, but one step at a time.